The President, please be seated. Le Président, Mesdames et Messieurs, veuillez vous asseoir. The chamber is now in session. Nous reprenons l'audience. We will continue to hear the testimony of the witness. Nous allons continuer à entendre le témoin. Saumet. Monsieur Saumet. Before we continue listening to the witness, Avant I would like to give the débat, floor nous souhaiterions to the donner la parole co to aux co-procureurs. To this witness, you have 30 minutes. Vous avez 30 minutes. The president, the co-procureur, can you? Pause for a moment. Alain Werner, you Un may instant, proceed. Maître Werner, vous souhaitez intervenir. Werner, sorry to, to, um, to be on my feet, just to report very, very briefly, juste pour following the observa observation from the defense yesterday, that for next week they may have some issue with one of our civil party, E2-50, and I told you on us yesterday that we would give some new materials um, for inspection for the defense, and we did. And so I just want to report that the defense was able to, uh, to see this material. And again, uh, a motion will be filed on, on Thursday, hopefully, with all the, uh, the materials for all the parties. Thank you. L'ensemble des documents à l'ensemble des parties. Je vous remercie. The president, I notice the presence of the lawyer. You may proceed. Je note la présence de Maître Fabien Trussen. The civil party council. You may proceed. Je vous en prie. Allez-y, de manière à ce que nous euh, ne perdions pas de temps et que l'on puisse euh, passer à, à l'audition de notre témoin. Allez-y. Oui, Monsieur le Président, Mr. je Snapples. me permets d'intervenir justement Mr. pour que nous puissions gagner du temps like euh, ultérieurement, so euh, puisqu'en effet, euh, dans le cadre des recherches que With nous avons pu faire dans les dossiers des, de nos partis civils, euh, nous sommes en cours de euh, traitement de certains euh, documents, mais nous pouvons d'ores et déjà, aujourd'hui, vous indiquer que nous today, euh, renonçons à l'audition du dossier the E2 82 et que nous espérons donc euh, pouvoir avoir les documents permettant les auditions du E2 81 nous espérons avoir ces documents entre aujourd'hui et demain, faute de quoi, tomorrow. là encore, nous vous indiquons que case, nous renoncerons à l'audition de cette partie. Right enfin, dernière observation, nous avons pris connaissance Lastly, de la décision de la Cour en ce qui concerne la demande de protection de la partie civile de 89. Il n'y a aucune de notre part. We de la partie offer no challenge qui accepte de comparaître party, euh, normalement et euh, de ce, je vous indique cela de normally. façon à ce que le dossier puisse être adressé so dans les meilleurs délais à la défense. Voilà les observations que je ne vais pas faire pour aujourd'hui, M. le possible. Président. Je vous en remercie. These are my submissions for this morning. Thank you.
President the Civil Party Council for Group 3. Can you state again the purpose of your submission regarding the civil parties that you are representing? And which civil party statements that you wish the chamber to examine or what you have submitted is the information for the chamber only? Um, Monsieur le Président, je faisais Mr. simplement President, cette remarque uh, afin de prévoir so uh, la journée du uh, 17 où nous the devons 17th, examiner donc, les possibilités d'audition des partis civils et d'ores et déjà modalities for the hearing of the civil parties. So, in order to deal with the problem of the chamber's planning, I was saying that we are no longer going to call a civil party E282 and that we are processing the documents aujourd'hui ou demain dans le dossier E de 81. To si civil party nous n'obtenons pas 81. ces documents, If we do not nous obtain the documents, que nous renoncerons aussi à l'audition de cette partie civile. Si nous les avons, ask for this bien civil entendu, to be nous continuerons, If nous maintiendrons notre demande d'audition. C'est une question pratiquement d'heure. Nous devrions heard. avoir euh, normalement so ces Under normal circumstances, the documents should be available when needed. The president, oui, Judge afin Lavoie, de, de bien clarifier les choses, Judge vous nous dites Lavoie, que vous renoncez d'ores et déjà à l'audition d'une partie civile et que vous envisagez le cas échéant, si vous n'avez pas suffisamment de documents à fournir à la Cour, à renoncer à l'audition d'une seconde partie civile. Peut-être serait-il plus clair de nous dire si cette renonciation vous équivaut à un retrait complet de la demande de consommation de partie civile ou si c'est simplement une renonciation à l'audition. Parce que je pense que les choses ne seront pas les mêmes, notamment du point de vue de la défense. C'est une simple renonciation à l'audition, Monsieur le Président. Merci. Now I would like to give the floor Je to the co-prosecutors to put questions to this witness. Co-prosecutor, thank you, Mr. President. Good morning, Mr. Salmet. Bonjour, Monsieur Salmet. My first question to you. Voici ma première question. Yesterday you described about the tortures. Hier, vous nous avez committed in the detention facility at S21 while you were guarding outside at those special prisons. Did you ever witness the torture act where a prisoner was stripped off and a water was poured on the prisoner and a fan was used to cool down the water? Refroidir response. le prisonnier. As I said, whatever I dis, said, it was all true. Quoi que j'ai pu dire, 
city. Thank you, so it's the co prosecutor. In your interview with the co investigating judges, you mentioned the VCS tortured where a prisoner was stripped of clothes and water was poured, and a friend was used to cool the water. So you still stand by your standard? Response. Yes, prisoner. It was true. I do not fabricate it. Le refroidir. Est-ce que vous maintenez cette déclaration? Question, Réponse says oui. The je euh, je n'ai rien inventé. When you worked as the question. guard at S21, je passe à ma did question you sur ever participate in euh, training euh, where you were taught about the rules or how to protect and how to avoid the prisoners from escaping euh, and various other measures? Afin de Response. vous apprendre à éviter toute évasion. Yes, of there were trainings, livelihood meetings. Réponse oui, il y avait des formations, des réunions de vie. Nous donner des instructions not allow the prisoners escape or not to be given in to the prisoners and not to the prisoners to conduct any activities or to let them die or to go really anywhere. Uh, the discipline was very strict at the time. Tout suicide, Question. Toute évasion. With the President's leave, I would like to show a document, P0000025, zero, 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 on the screen. Um, avec la présidente, avec la permission the du président, the AV officer, can you show the document um, nous souhaiterions with the Z-E-N number, P00000022, and the number of the president, I pray the responsible uh, audiovisual, bien vouloir afficher uh, ce document. Co -prosecutor, co -prosecutor, Mr. Sommet, Mr. Sommet, this is an a drawing by Van Nat, who was a former Esmeran prisoner. Um, Yesterday, you responded to Judge Lavenge Hier, that you witnessed Lavenge, the torture by using ribbon sticks, de torture, by using electrical uh, shock and nail pulling. Shock, Can you tell uh, the chamber now? Regarding the tortures, as you mentioned yesterday, whether you pouvez vous dire si vous avez été tortures as de tels actes de torture on the comme celui qui est présenté sur cette peinture. At that time. The torture Réponse which was done at uh, the place where I got it was different from the place where the nails were pulled. Because at that location, when the prisoners were taken out to be interrogated, and when they came back, I saw the signs of nails which had been pulled. But at my location, nails were not pulled. Gardé, and the water on was not poured on the prisoner. Et on ne versait pas de l'eau sur les euh, mains du prisonnier. And what about the using of a needle to insert under the nail? Did you witness that? Pour insérer ces aiguilles sous l'ongle, avez-vous été témoin de tels Response. actes? At that time, I did not witness it personally. I saw a prisoner was being walked to be detained at the location where I got it. Pour ce qui est des prisonniers qu'on emmenait dans l'endroit où j'étais, à l'endroit où j'étais de faction. Question. Question. When you were transferred to Preso, when you were transferred to Preso. What about the, your unit, the unit which instructed you and transferred you to Preso, prohibited you from saying anything about the activities at Preso, at S21, correct, Response. Response. When I was assigned to go there, I was not instructed on anything regarding the saying about the S21 activity. I was told that, comrade, you 
prepare your own belonging and now you are transferred to go and work at Trio dit. Thank you, says the co-prosecutor. Upon your arrival at that location, can you tell the chamber the, the structure of administration at that location? Response. Upon my arrival, I was inserted into a unit working in the rice fields. Travaillant la rizière. So uh, there was nothing strange besides Donc, leaking canals or building dams. De, de, de particulier à part le, le fait de uh, creuser des canaux, um, de uh, diriger and des the food that we received uh, was not sufficient. alimentaire que nous recevions n'était pas suffisante. Working condition was hard. We worked more hours at that location, and the discipline was strict. Après ça, Thank you, sir, the co-prosecutor. Also, at that location, what was you what were you regarded as? Vous étiez considéré comme quoi? Quel était votre statut? Were you regarded as? Étiez-vous considéré comme? in the medium category or serious category or light category la catégorie des détenus lourds ou des détenus légers it was my understanding at that time that upon ce que j'ai pu comprendre when i was sent to that location i was not yet categorized into any of these levels the concern was that my brother was arrested and detained at S21. And as I reported earlier, only Hui, who told me about the arrest of my brother, as first he asked whether I had a brother named Sao Main and where he lived. And I told him accordingly, from what I knew, he lived at the airfield in Kampung Penang. Then he told me that he was arrested and asked me to be silent and not to break this news, otherwise I would have been arrested. And from the understanding of what he said, I had to keep it secret. Uh, so. J'ai compris que je devais ne rien dire. Thank you, Mr. Samad. I do not have any question. more questions for you. Je vous remercie, Monsieur Samad. And I would like now to give the floor to my international colleague. Donner la parole à mon collègue international. Thank you, Mr. Samad. I am one more prosecutor, like my friend who are assisting this court in searching for the truth about what happened in S21. I thank you, in fact, we thank you for your truthfulness that you have demonstrated when you gave an interview to the investigators of the investigating judges yesterday and when you were taken by the investigating judges to S21 during reconstruction. I am just, for the purposes of the learned judges here, trying to confirm what you spoke to the investigators of the investigating judges, so that the judges and the public have a clear idea of what happened at S21, and a complete record of history is maintained. So I will not ask many questions, but just for your confirmation about what you have already told various uh, bodies like the investigators of this court. During your interview with the investigators in November, just about two years ago, you told them about how interrogation took place. And these were your words, and I would just request you to confirm for us this is what your understanding of the interrogations was. Sometimes, Toy inter interrogated, and if he was unclear, then Doig came in and asked the prisoner, are you going to talk to us or not? Do you think this is what happened? Voilà. Est-ce que tu vas euh, nous parler ou pas 
Est-ce que vous pensez que c'est comme ça que les choses se sont produites Response. Réponse. Whatever statement I've made in my interview is truthful. Lors de mon audition, I did not fabricate anything, and maybe I could not even recall more details regarding those accounts. Because it has been so many years already, so everything was true. Thank you very much, Mr. Sommet. I am not meaning at all that you are fabricating anything. I'm just trying to record for this court exactly what you told the investigators. So when these judges decide at the time of their judgment, they have the full truth before them. And I will just read to you. And you can say the same thing, whether you agree to what you said to the investigators. The prisoners would answer, I have already reported everything to you, brother. There is nothing else to report. Then Doik would kick the prisoner once or twice and say, soon you will know. A moment later, they would come up and threaten and beat the prisoner so that the prisoner would answer. I just would want request you to tell the court that this is indeed what you told the investigators. Je voulais préciser devant la chambre que c'est effectivement, et je voulais vous demander par ailleurs si c'est effectivement ce que vous avez dit devant les co-juges d'instruction. Response. Réponse. At that time, I told the investigators of the co-investigating judge's office, and it is true. And one last thing, and then I'll be done with, just for your confirmation. You told the investigators if Doik did not go anywhere, he would come to the prisoner's site almost daily. Can you just confirm that for us, please? Euh, sur le lieu où j'effectuais mes gardes. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous confirmer cette information voilà, Réponse. Response. At that time, I did uh, make my statement, but probably uh, it was a little bit uh, excessive. Actually, he did not come on a daily basis, so I apologize for this minor mistake. Je vous prie de m'excuser. So how often do you think he came? Um, question, à quelle fréquence, selon vous, uh, venait-il là? Response. Réponse. At that time, if he wanted to grasp the understanding si of the case, he would come. Passé, or when he um, was available, he would just vis -vis walk through and inspect in the prisoners' rooms. Voir ce qui se dans Thank you very much, Mr. Sommet. And I'll just question, recall remercie, a statement that you gave about three years ago to the investigators of the Documentation Center for Cambodia. I will not read that statement to you, but just extract one sentence from there and request for you to confirm that sentence. You told the investigators of the Documentation Center for Cambodia, this was in January 2003, that many foreigners including Americans, were burned on the road west to S-21. Do you recall that happening? Response. At that time, there was a guard who spoke about it, and I overheard it, but I myself did not witness it. Did that guard tell you that he saw the burning of the foreigners? Response. He did not tell me personally. But he told the people who worked with the record keeping and the documents, then I overheard it. Thank you very much for that clarification and for your, once again, your truthfulness. Now I will ask you three or four questions. 
about the people who were imprisoned, whom you were entrusted to guard. There is evidence before this court that they were made to write very long confessions. Did you see them doing that with pen and paper in their rooms when you guarded them? Est-ce que vous avez pu être témoin de cela Est-ce que vous les avez vus écrire leurs aveux Response. Yes, I did. Réponse, oui, effectivement. Were you also told that these people Question, were very important people and that special care should be taken to protect them Ces personnes devaient faire l'objet d'attention tout à fait particulière pour les protéger. Response. The chief of the team the chef and told us that uh, the prisoners were important people and that we had to take special care. Did Doric also Question. tell you such kind of a thing? Responses. No, he didn't. No. But uh, the chiefs of our team told us about this. I believe that uh, these kind of instructions or advice could have been passed down from him to the chiefs of our team. Do you remember Question. any prominent figure or any names of persons that you guarded or your colleagues guarded in that special prison? Response, no, I don't. Because at that time, we were not allowed to know this, even among our guards. You were chosen for this very important task of guarding special prisoners. Do you think you were chosen for some special quality that you had over and above other guards who were guarding ordinary prisoners? Response. I don't know what special quality I had, uh, but I was assigned by the superior and uh, illiterate people would be assigned to a different section while uh, people who would be able to read and write would be assigned to guard these. Prisoners. Just one or two last questions about your interaction with Duke, the accused here. You saw him very regularly. What kind of a figure was he for the guards in S21? Response. I cannot uh, tell anything about his characteristic back then. Did the guards and even your superiors uh, fear him? Were they afraid that if they did anything that annoyed him, they may be punished? Response. Réponse. Of course, I was afraid oui, bien of sûr, him. Je le craignais. At the messenger unit, uh, which consisted Au of about 50 people, after all, only four to five people personnes. remained. The rest disappeared gradually, and uh, we could not see their faces during meal times any longer, so I started to fear him.
Et j'ai commencé à avoir peur, à le craindre, oui. How was he when you talked Question. when he talked to the guards? Was he smiling? Comment was he arrogant? Est-ce qu'il souriait? Est-ce qu'il était arrogant? Balo, good ha- réponse. Response. I think he did not uh, talk to guards uh, in an arrogant manner at all. Sometimes he smiled, sometimes he laughed. Did you see anybody higher than Doik in S21, and especially coming to the prisoners, the special prisoners whom you were guarding? Response. Réponse. No, I non. didn't. I didn't see any persons higher than him who lui. came to the location. I saw only him, Chan, Chan, and Hor. No other people. Personne d'autre. This means, for the two Question. years Ça that you were guarding, you saw Doik in control of S21 and always in charge, and everybody S21. else. Fearing him, is that a correct assessment? Et pendant tout ce temps, il était craint. Est-ce exact? Bah, très bien. Réponse. Response. Oui, yes, it is correct. And you may not have heard Question. it, and you can tell us if that is not the case. But did ever Doik in any political meeting or at any other time that you heard him say? that if anything wrong happened at S21, he will be punished by his superiors. Response. No, I did not hear that. Thank you very much, Mr. President. I have no further questions to this witness. And thank you, Mr. Sommet, for your truthfulness and for your forthrightness. Témoin que je remercie pour euh, ces réponses précises et franches. Le président. The president. Next, we would like to give the floor to the civil parties euh, lawyers to be able to put civils. questions to this witness. You take the floor. Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President. Your Honours, Monsieur le Président, Madame, Messieurs les Juges, I would like to indicate uh, the time allocation for the civil party lawyers today. We have two groups now. The first group begins with uh, in the first group. I will put questions first. And uh, the third group uh, will put Et questions later. Par le groupe numéro trois. I have a couple of questions. Je souhaite poser quelques questions. My name is D. Srina, a civil party lawyer of Group 1, and uh, Mr. Alain Huerner, who is my co colleague. Mr. Summit, uh, good morning. I would like to seek clarification from Monsieur you témoin, in relation to the statement you made les déclarations que vous avez faites on the 28th of November 2007 with ERN 0016-3653 in Khmer, in English, 0016-3653. Before the co-investigating judges, you responded uh, that Monsieur according to what you remember during the time you were on guard at each room, whether you heard uh, the scream, any screaming from the detainees, and you said that you heard detainees uh, 
cried for help and begged uh, that uh, the interrogators stop beating them and that um, uh, they did not want them to beat them. Do you stand by your statement? Do you stand by your statement? Response. Réponse. I do stand by my oui, statement that I made before the co-investigating charges. May I also seek another Maître point of clarification, say this You were asked whether you had si observed that detainees in each room received uh, torture. And you said that uh, everyone was tortured and they had uh, been inflicted serious tortures. And when the guards saw detainees being interrogated, uh, they themselves, the guards, uh, were terrified also. Do you stand by your statement that uh, the guards were also frightened uh, by the practice of torture? Response, I do stand by my statement and I don't ever change it. Tisrina, next question. Yesterday you indicated in relation to Toy. You said that one day Toy used a stick to beat uh, on the detainee on the back until he was bleeding. And then Toy used other instruments of torture, including the electric wire to attach to his earlobes to electroshock the uh, detainee until he passed out and when he regained consciousness then they uh, re-interrogated uh, him. So do you believe that Doi was such a cruel person like what you said uh, in your statement? Can you uh, describe his character? Response. What I have said earlier is true. And uh, in such interrogation, violence could not be avoided. Tisrina, I just would like you to tell us about the personality of Toy. Was he an arrogant, a cruel person, or just a normal individual? Response. Toy, who was the interrogator, was not a usual person. As an interrogator, uh, he was very cruel. Tisrina, do you know whether Toy had any relationship with uh, Deutsch, the accused? Response. Interrogators and Deutsch relationship is not known to me. Tisrina, while Toy inflicted tortures on the detainees, do you know that Deutsch was satisfied with such acts? Satisfait du genre de torture que Toy infligé aux prisonniers. I have no idea. Je n'en ai aucune idée. Tisrina, I may proceed with another question. Je vais passer à une autre question. In your statement uh, of your interview with the DC CAM on the 31st of January 2002 with ER number 0051 in Khmer, in English 0033. 0536 In that document, uh, you gave the interview to the staff member of DC Camp, and you were asked, 
whether you gave uh, food uh, or rice to the detainee or whether you knew uh, them. And you said you only met uh, your chief, who was the chief of uh, the platoon, the battalion, no, the battalion correction. And you said that he was the chief of battalion and Donc, connaître le chef de bataillon. The chief of battalion 703 and uh, il s'agissait du 703 I was bataillon. his former messenger. Vous avez indiqué and when I witnessed je cite, such thing, I was in dismay. Et lorsque j'assistais à I was afraid chose, I would be trapped in the same situation when network was to be discovered. Quand on découvrirait My question un is, réseau. What happened to P when he was arrested and sent to S21? Response. At that time, I forgot, but now with this kind of uh, refreshness, and I can recall that P was the chief of uh, my unit. Uh, Chef unit 303, and uh, it was during the war time, 74, 75, and I saw him under the wooden house, and then I left because I was afraid that I would be implicated uh, because of my association with uh, my chief. And then when he was, um, I, I, I believe that when he was uh, uh, c tortured or, or interrogated, it would implicate me, and I think I remember this uh, me memory. Question. Question. Do you remember any staff from 703 who worked at S21? Response. There were people from 703 who worked at S21 because the messenger uh, unit uh, consisted of all people from 703 and they were mixed up with the people from the West uh, and from Kampung Chnang. But actually these people had already already been working in the unit before we came. This Rina. Do you know that uh, the majority of staff member from Division 703 were smashed at S21? Response. I know that uh, a lot of people from 703 were smashed, but we only learned uh, from one another. We did not witness the execution because the chief of uh, the unit would uh, tell us that people from 703 have already been taken in and taken out. Tizina, do you know how many people from 703 were executed? Response, no, I don't know, because uh, I did not uh, fully observe uh, the numbers of people who were killed. Question, when you were told that all people from 703 have already been brought in, did you seek any clarification from the person who told you about this, why uh, people from 703 were all arrested? Response. No, I did not uh, seek any clarification from my um, colleague uh, because it was the rule at uh, the location that uh, we were not allowed to communicate with one another. Parler entre nous de ce genre de choses. This Rina, yesterday you Question. indicated in the hearing that uh, vous avez dit there was a small incident in relation to the staff member of S21 who left uh, a scarf near the window and then he left uh, and that the detainee took the advantage of the opportunity to grab that scarf uh, to attempt suicide. Uh, but then you was quick to be there 
and that uh, the attempt was failed, and that uh, you tried to help uh, conceal the secrecy uh, in order to avoid uh, any prosecution in, uh, on that guard. Did you say that? Response. Of course, I did. Yes. This is what I said, did you intend to help uh, the guard? Vous avez ainsi essayé d'aider ce garde? Response. Réponse. Yes, I did. Oui, effectivement. Because if I did not Parce help si uh, to fait, hide si this incident, that cet incident, that guard could have been jailed or could have been refashioned or re-educated. Soit interné à son tour, soit envoyé en rééducation. This is a question. I would like to ask a question in relation to Hui. This morning you said you said something about Hui. Was it true that Hui helped you when he sent you to the rice fields? En vous envoyant à la rizière. Response. Réponse. Yes, it is true. If Hoi did not help oui, me, si I would be in aider, big trouble already. Été en grande difficulté. Tisrina. Question. In relation to your work at S21, du que vous à S21 to what extent was you, were you given the authority Dans to operate uh, within the vicinity of S21? Le pouvoir the response, could you please repeat your question? I don't understand it. Thank you. I will try question. my best oui, to simplify the question. Regarding the power or authority you can exercise at S21, did the ah, upper echelon of your superior, superior delegate uh, any kind of power to you to operate to what uh, to the extent at S21? De vos fonctions à S21. Response. Réponse. No power or authority non, was ever be delegated to me, and I was only assigned and functioned to guard uh, the detainees, and that's all. Tisrina, I would like Question. to move back a little bit, and I would like Je to apologize for skipping one question. I would like to Et also seek effet, clarification regarding the help of Hui, who tried to help you by sending you to work at Presaw. At that time, Hui could help you, of course. But was it possible to help the other people in general at S21 at that time? For example, by way of uh, uh, sending you to the field, as an example, as what Hui did to you? Par exemple, en vous envoyant à la rizière comme il, où il a fait. Response. Réponse. Hui helped me with that, but I did not know Alors, whether it was possible for him vrai, to help si uh, the other. But of course, he did gens. help me. En tout cas, dans mon cas, il l'a fait. Tisrina, next question. Question. I would like to put for the question in relation to your rights of communication to the superior. Quelques questions en rapport avec vos communications avec vos supérieurs. Did you have the right to meet uh, directly with superior or upper echelon and to contact with them? L'échelon supérieur ou d'être en contact avec lui. Response. Réponse. At that time, I was only 
delegated some kind of functions or, or tasks. Uh, and and I was instructed tâches, by my chief of the team, that's all, not from the other superiors. Je pas de contact avec Question. What kind of information could you obtain or did you have the right to obtain from your chief of the unit? Uh, were you able to receive or access to information in relation to politics or the armed conflicts? La situation politique ou le, le, un conflit armé. Réponse. À that time, I, I'm not sure whether I obtained any information regarding these matters or I had the right to do so. I think I didn't. Ce genre de question ou si j'avais ce droit. This Rina. Question. Now I'm talking about the freedom of movement. At that time, you said uh, you saw the accused wandering in the vicinity of the location. So can you please tell the court whether during that time that when you worked at the staff of S21, what was your freedom of movement and what was the freedom of the accused of movement? Response. At that time, honestly, when Deutsch came, whether I was on guard or off Quand duty, I saw him. Because oui, pu le voir. Soit de garde, how soit could I not see him? Because I was working there. This Rina, I'm sorry to interrupt, uh, but I would like to si ask about your rights of movement Mais to walk within the S21 and move about elsewhere uh, as opposed to the rights of movement of the accused. Par comparaison avec, uh, le droit de Response. Réponse. The accused uh, Move, uh, freedoms of movement was not known to me, Je ne sais pas, uh, but I am sure that uh, I, am, I was very well disciplined uh, and I could not move part, uh, about easily and uh, I was not allowed to do so and I could only move uh, back to the kitchen and the place where I worked. Tisrina, thank you very much, Mr. Samed. Uh, on behalf of the civil party lawyers and the civil party, we are very grateful to your assistance. Vous remercie de votre aide au nom des parties civiles. Mr. President, uh, civil party lawyers group three, you take the floor. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Ms. Fabienne Trusna, Bonjour, Monsieur Sommet. Hello, Je m'appelle Fabienne Trusse. Good morning, Mr. Je suis co-avocat pour le groupe Trus. numéro 3 am, uh, the, auprès de uh, Sovereign Marie Mnock. Number three. Je n'aurai que quelques I questions uh, à vous uh, to poser. Put to you. Vous nous avez parlé you spoke to us des conditions the qui pour vous étaient extrêmement dures pour les prisonniers harsh. qui se trouvaient dans l'unité spéciale que vous gardiez. Which you were Mais la question que je veux vous poser est, est-ce est que you vous savez is, quelles étaient les conditions you know des autres prisonniers qui se trouvaient dans les autres bâtiments Response. Response. I did not know what happened to the Je other people in other buildings. Vous 
vous n'en discutiez pas Mistress avec les Napoli, autres gardiens did you not discuss this with the other guards? No, I didn't. Réponse, non. Because Je n'en discutais pas. The discipline pas. was very strict when we were Car supposed to guard uh, the detainees. Then our Lorsque duty was to guard the detainees, not garde des anything else. Tel était notre uh, fonction, notre responsabilité, et on ne faisait rien d'autre. Merci, M. Sommet. Vous avez, euh, par ailleurs, you, indiqué aussi dans you votre déposition euh, que Doug était le responsable des entrées et des sorties du personnel, de, des prisonniers. The prisoners vous le saviez alors que vous ne saviez pas pas véritablement quelles étaient, quelles étaient ses fonctions. C'est ce que vous avez you did indiqué. Not exactly what Comment pouvez-vous le savoir so how could you know this? Réponse. I knew it. Je le savais. Because of the group chief or the team's chief Parce during the meetings. During the meetings, we were told the planning was coming from Brother Dutch. On nous disait que les instructions venaient de Hoy and Duke, and then to us. de Hoy, Hoy et Sre. Et ensuite, ces informations nous arrivaient. Vous avez aussi indiqué que vous avez assisté à des scènes de torture parce que pendant votre garde, vous regardiez par une lucarne ce qui se passait dans les cellules. Et vous êtes notamment une des personnes qui avait donné des renseignements qui n'ont pas été donné par d'autres par d'autres gardiens notamment et notamment sur euh, certaines tortures qui étaient infligées aux prisonniers notamment l'électrocution par les parties so au niveau des parties génitales est-ce que vous pourrez confirmer cette déclaration et nous donner des précisions can you comment vous avez statement? vu and can you give us ces scènes exactement as to uh, what you saw et combien when you de fois vous avez pu Uh, entrevoir Could ces you scènes. also tell us on how many occasions you were able to see what was going on? But look at the Réponse. I would like to clearly state that. Je souhaiterais établir clairement. What I saw and knew. Je voyais ce que je savais was true and I did witness it at the time and now I don't want to repeat what I already said. J'étais le témoin. J'ai été témoin de ces événements passés. Maintenant, je ne souhaite pas répéter ce que j'ai déjà dit. Je vous remercie. Vous avez confirmé yes, donc une Napoli. nouvelle fois Thank et you. ça you me paraît important car more. vous êtes en effet le seul à avoir donné certaines de ces précisions. Je voudrais par contre leur poser une question Now I would like qui est plus personnelle. Personal Qu'avez-vous ressenti quand vous avez appris What que votre frère était arrêté that your brother had been arrested? Réponse. Upon hearing the news that my brother was arrested, my feeling of course was not stable. I was anxious and I did not focus much on my work at the time. But he advised me to be strong and not to say anything. 
and that he would try to il have me by concealing that information. That was dissimuler ces informations. C'est tout. Je vous remercie. Ms. Trous Napoles, uh, thank you. Je voudrais maintenant venir sur Pressar. I would now like to turn to Pressar. Uh, si des prisonniers pendant que vous know, étiez à Pressar ont Pressar, été libérés. Whether there were prisoners freed there. Response. Réponse. When I went to stay at Preso, it was difficult for me to clearly see j'étais après ça which location il m'était difficile for the de voir or which were the prisons itself because my main focus at the time was to work in the rice fields la prison elle-même parce qu'en fait ce que je devais surtout faire à l'époque c'était de travailler à la rizière je vous remercie monsieur Sommet, Sommet et je n'aurai pas d'autres questions thank you mr Sommet. i have no further questions for you The president. Le président. Next, I would like to give the floor to the Defense Council. Au Conseil de la Défense. If they have questions, si to be to questions you may proceed. À ce témoin, je vous en prie. Can I support? Thank you, Mr. President. Je vous remercie, Monsieur le Good Président. Good morning, Your Honour. Bonjour, Mesdames et Messieurs. Good morning, les ladies juges. and gentlemen. Bonjour, Mesdames et Messieurs. Mr. Saumet, Monsieur Saumet, you stated that Hoi assisted you, and if Hoi were to report about si you, Hoy then Hoy it would be the end of you. Is this correct? De ce qui se passait, c'était uh, cela aurait question. Um, signifié so, que c'était uh, votre fin. Staff, if the lower level subordinates, for example, question, the chiefs of platoons or companies de de that de did not report to Deutsch, ne Deutsch, Deutsch pas who not know about those arrests, is this non, correct? Pas eu connaissance de ces arrestations. Est -ce exact? It's problematic if the lower level Réponse, did not report to un, the un subordinate si to the upper level of the Dutch, then Dutch would not know. De ce qui se à During Duke, Duke each pas livelihood meeting, pendant les réunions de we were criticized or we had to self-criticize. And based on the results of the criticisms et and the qualities, la base then, des résultats uh, des ces would be exercices made and de would be arrested later on. Des, une enquête avait lieu et ensuite Question. cela conduisait you à une arrestation. Question, At the rooms vous étiez where you guarded, did you ever see Là the display of the ten rooms of the Sun Avez-vous vu les, euh, les inscriptions Response. précisant les règles du Santébal sur un tableau. Il y avait des règles concernant I le fait de travailler, de manger, de dormir. Et je me con Question. conformais à Can ces règles. Question, pouvez-vous confirmer une nouvelle fois les dix règles du Saint-Ébal euh, dont je viens de faire allusion in the interrogation room or on a wall anywhere, for example, uh, rule one, par you exemple, have to enter uh, straight to the question and and do not stray part, from it. Did you ever see un, such display? Vous devez répondre directement aux questions et ne pas vous écarter Response. du sujet. Um, Avez-vous jamais At vu time, une I did not see anything uh, on the wall. Réponse. I only je learned the rules rien during the meetings. Inscrit sur les murs, j'ai simplement appris ces but règles it was not written au cours des réunions. The wall. Mais I'm not sure. Pas, Here, I talk pas about myself. It might be displayed somewhere else. Affiche. Peut-être que ces règles n'étaient pas affichées là où je travaillais, mais autre part. 
question. In the document 0016563, you told the investigators that the prisoners were bitten to bitten to confess, and if they did not confess, they would be bitten to death. Is this true? My statement was true. Ma déclaration reflétait la vérité. Question. Question. Did you ever see an interrogator torture a prisoner to death? Un prisonnier à mort? Response. Réponse. The interrogator did not beat a prisoner to death. Once the interrogation was complete, the prisoner would be taken out. Of course, they were tortured during the interrogation, but they were not dead. Question. So, your statement before the investigators that the prisoners were not beaten to death, if the prisoners did not confess, the prisoners would be beaten or tortured to death. And now you clearly state to the chamber that during the interrogation, the prisoner was not beaten to death. So, are you standing? By okay. your statement you just made before this chamber or the statement before the investigators? Maintenez-vous la déclaration plutôt que vous avez faite devant les coups d'instruction. Réponse. At that time, I made a statement to the investigators and I stand by my. Statement. That was the opportunity for me to speak, and now I don't think I have the that same opportunity before this chamber. Question. So you do not stand by the statement you just made before this chamber, and you stood by the statement before the investigators. D twenty-eight, three. Au document D28, infraction 3, la cote ERN 0016353665. A prisoner was received the electric shock and became unconscious. But if a prisoner was bitten, then that prisoner would not become unconscious. Can you explain to us the difference? Pouvez-vous nous expliquer la nuance? I would like to tell you clearly that when a rattan stick was used, then a prisoner was never unconscious. But if a prisoner received electric shock, that prisoner would become unconscious. That is all. Si un prisonnier recevait des chocs électriques, celui-ci perd des connaissances. Voilà. C'est tout. Question. Do you work at S21? Did you know? The S21 medics. So were there any female medics or child medics at S21? Regarding the medics, I only knew three, and he he was male, of course, and he frequently came to the special prison. I did not see any female or child medic. There might be those child or female medics inside the compound. Peut-être que cela pu être le cas pour ce qui est des femmes. Question, vous gardez S21. Avez-vous jamais vu tuer de ses propres mains un prisonnier Réponse, je ne l'ai jamais vu tuer quelqu'un ou qui que ce soit. Thank you for your statement that you never saw Dutch killed anyone. At S21, did you know if there were any senior leaders above Dutch and issued orders to Dutch? Au placé qui donnait leur instruction à Dutch, à savoir est-ce que vous saviez s'il y avait des supérieurs de Dutch? 
was just an ordinary combatant. I do not know anything about the senior people about such. I guarded the prisoner inside the room, and I do not know anything about any senior people about Dutch or their visits. I only saw Dutch and Chan at that office. Duke, je ne voyais que Duke et Chan à S21. Question. Question. You were a guard. Vous étiez Did you garde. ever receive any direct Vous order from Duke? Reçu d'instruction directement de Duke. Response. Réponse. My duty was not directly ordered or assigned by Dutch. It was assigned by my team chief during that period. Thank you for saying that you never received direct order from Dutch. At that time, I mean at the time that you still get at S21, were you satisfied with your de votre travail. Response. I would like to tell you clearly that in my mind, I was not satisfied with my work at all because people were arrested and killed. So inside my mind, that was the truth. But outside, I would not display this feeling, otherwise I would be arrested. Publiquement Thank you for saying that you were not uh, satisfied with um, your guard duty at at anyone as the rest of the other guards previously testified before this chamber. Ce, ce now, qui ont do you um, regret your guard duty as you did at S21? Response. People who used to stay together and work together, of course, there was a regret because we could not understand if there was any reason for their arrest and detention. If it is my understanding that they would not, they or they should not be arrested, it's like using a cow or an ox and then kill that cow or ox. Thank you for vache, saying that you um, was not satisfied with your duty at S21. My next question is, if you were not satisfied with your work at S21, why did you not attempt to escape? At that moment, if you were not happy, why did you not attempt to escape or to escape from the police? Fleeing? What you want, where you want me to flee? Outside there were walls. Inside there were walls. Where do you want me to flee? And if I were to successfully escape, then my parents, my relatives at the native village would be arrested and brought to that prison. They would be killed, that's all. Question. The staff or the guards who guarded S21 can you tell us whether they were not satisfied with their work and they say they are because they had nowhere to run to? Et qu'ils ne s'échappaient pas parce qu'ils n'avaient nulle part où aller. I could not speak on their behalf because at that time nobody trusted anybody. If if we were to trust each other, that would not have happened. Thank you, Mr. President. I do not have any question for this witness. And I would like to give the floor to my international counsel. Donner la parole à présent à ma consoeur internationale. The International Defense Council, you may proceed. Le Conseil international de l'accusé, je vous en prie. Je vous remercie, Monsieur, Monsieur le Président, mais la Défense n'a pas d'autres questions à poser aux témoins. But the Defense has no further questions for this witness. The President, the Chamber would like now to give the opportunity to the accused to make his observations regarding this witness testimony if the accused wishes to do so. 
s'agissant de l'audition de ce témoin. Je vous en prie, monsieur l'accusé. Mr. President, Monsieur le Président, I like to dit l'accusé, je souhaiterais préciser I que have never known this comrade met. je n'ai jamais eu connaissance du camarade Met pendant by the co la confrontation organisée par les Met juges. Je savais que Met était le frère cadet du camarade appearance. Main et ce parce que je pouvais établir And des similarités physiques entre ces deux personnes. Un membre de l'Atomy 1 staff a member of the special force des forces working spéciales outside. du personnel de S21 travaillant à l'extérieur. Et lorsque j'ai vu shocked. le visage de Matt, j'étais uh, choqué that May and his five uh, plein de regrets et que And that uh, I had a pity on Maid, uh, uh, who was demoted from a guard at S21 and Maître, was later transferred to work in a rice field. That was my feeling for Comrade Maid. Tels étaient les sentiments Second point. qui m'habitaient vis-à-vis de camarade the testimony Met. Of this Deuxièmement, camarade s'agissant du témoignage in general, it de camarade true. Met, dans les grandes lignes, cela reflète la euh, vérité. However, Cependant, the point that I went to torture le point selon prisoner lequel je suis location, venu euh, torturer les prisonniers, là où je like Toy, je make the point ne, je ne l'aurais pas nié si je l'avais fait. Cependant, j'aimerais établir les choses très clairement. S21, en tant que directeur de S21, et des crimes des politiques d'indoctrination que j'ai provoqué à ces gens, par exemple, le document du 18 février 1976, que j'ai apporté à ces gens City resistance forces and then uh, eliminated their existing views and documented them with the views I got from that document. So, so with the view of the criminal intent Donc of the CPK, and that I had to give them instructions that anyone who was arrested by the party had to be considered the enemy, and that was the most serious crime that I committed, and that I am responsible for then more than 10,000 lives lost at S21. In addition to my acknowledgement, I also wrote what I thought And that I wrote those documents to my superior, and of course those documents were written by me. And that was my crime on the people who were not yet decided to be arrested by Anka, and I was the one who initiated it. So these are the two focal points that I would like to raise. Et Thirdly, ce, all the crimes points, committed at S21, relevé, tristement, regardless of form of torture, commis S21, quelle que soit la forme de, la tor de, de torture utilisée, and regardless whether the special force que soit used si or transported the prisoners to be executed somewhere else, they had to do it because of my instructions. So I do not deny all these crimes, I accept them. However, in whatever unit and in whatever society, each person fulfilled his or her task based on the assignment. A guard had to fulfill the guard's duty and could not do the interrogation job. And likewise, the interrogator could not split his time to carry the guard duty. And in the role of the leadership of S21, I would not have, I could not spare my time to involve with those interrogations, even if I wanted to do so. 
and that is the general principle. I do not deny that the allegations that it was a serious crime that I was alleged to beat a prisoner during an interrogation. Of course, I went to the interrogation location when Brother Mom Knight received his duty to summarize my the confessions that I worked on. So I went to that location and he reserved a chair for me. And at that time, Chao Tsai was detained there and every couple of months I went there to visit him. At Pond's location, from my recollection, I went there on two occasions. After the interrogation of Po Dun, who was an interrogator, who was an engineer from Kampontom. After the interrogation was completed Après, and I saw the scars and marks on his body and Pond requested me to meet him and why kill some Pond respectfully pet his great deal of respect and attitude to Pol Pot. Pol Pot Pond told me that Kirsten Pond was a person living in a room and fear of Pol Pot. So Tol Pot did not give me any reason for that, but instead he describes the process. Le processus. So that was the first time I Et went to the interrogation room of Camarade Pond. On the second Pond time, when Pond interrogated an Englishman, who came with a New Zealander, qui était arrivé avec un that uh, British, I could not uh, recall his name. Je ne peux pas me rappeler de son nom. So that Briton came along with a Et New Zealander and Bond told me that uh, he was very Martin humble and he behaved like a Cambodian. Uh, humble et qu'il se comportait comme un Cambodian. And the, the New Zealander, Amil, was there and when I Amil went to see là. him, Yes, he was humble and docile. So that was the second occasion I went to visit the Pond's place. I never went to Toy's place. Of course, I was aware of what was going on, and I knew that Toy used violence on the prisoners. But I did not simply react to anything happening at S21. I think I went once to Toy's location when a secretary from the Pop district was arrested, named Chao Wan, alias Kham. Uh, uh, this Chauvin person uh, was a former resistant. He was two or three resistant. years older than me. He uh, was from the Lam Paine's era. De, de, de plus que moi. He was de, a friend of uh, Sun Wissan, alias Nikon, the younger de, brother of Sun uh, Sen. And when Chauvin was arrested, my superior telephoned me from afar to play politics with Chauvin in order for him to confess. So I agreed to do so. And from my recollection, Chauvin even wrote that I went to meet him and that he was waiting for me in his confession. But I don't want to talk about his confession before this chamber now. But I believe it was mentioned in his confession. Cet épisode a été mentionné dans also, ses Also, this come, Chauvin Ellis come, come was the revolutionary name of Pain. So Dam Khan was also a friend of Dam Pain, and they all used the same alias, Kham. So I believed I went once to Toy's location, but in general, I did not go. Toy, mais de, en règle générale, je ne m'y rendais pas. I 
With the president's leave, I would like a document to be protected. That is the Toys record with the year N00, 07, 7, on the document regarding myself and Toys. The president, the Avi officer, can you protect the document with the year and 00077153 on the screen? The President, uh, the court official is now instructed to check with the AV unit whether the President, I would like to read. This is the comment uh, I uh, advised Toy. I said uh, this special group, including Pon, who was the first person, he did not read uh, right comrade Pon, but he used brother Pon instead. So this is how I as assigned the task, and I voilà, did not go there. That's why, after the complaint of Toy, then I asked Pon to help. Il que à Pon At any à occasion, Toye, plutôt, brothers from the upper went to the location, and the situation was chaotic. On peut lire ici que la situation était It was because of uh, the concept uh, to sell the mass, the workers, and the patients, and that our standpoint was not yet strong, and I don't want to continue anyway. This document is the document of S21, and it clarifies that I did not go there, but I helped uh, try to strengthen the spirit uh, of Toy. But Toy still was embedded with another concept uh, that he relied on Pon or me. So I would like uh, the AV Je unit also to be instructed to roll down to another Et page, which is page 514, just the next page, la, of la course. Page just scroll down a little bit. 54. The second reason, so there were seven points so and the, the second uh, the sorry the seven line uh, second reason ligne, on trouve une deuxième raison. and uh, we lost the direction to serve the people so every time he saw the upper echelon or superior came gens. to the location he just relied too much on them so this is how toy worked and, and I know for sure of how uh, Sao Maid uh, expressed in his statement about the cruelty, about the torture Toy would uh, use on the detainees, but I did not go there. 
uh, to Toy Place. And this is the document to prove that I did not go there. Although this is a document as an evidence to prove that I did not visit the location of Toy and I accept Mais and I acknowledge that Sao Maid uh, was the combatant and who had suffered a great deal as a guard in the special unit and who later on was sent to S21 for re-education and his brother Ming was arrested and executed and I really share the suffering and express my condolences to his family. Exprimer mes regrets au témoin et à sa famille. The president, uh, the hearing the of the testimony of Mr. Saumet comes to an end. The chamber is very grateful to Mr. Saumet for your attendance to give your testimony before the chamber. The extraordinary chambers in the courts of Cambodia as scheduled. The chamber note La how very difficult this has been for you. De l'épreuve que cela représente pour les témoins que de comparaître ici. It is very difficult because you has faced several questions que put by the parties who have the right to put questions to you during such proceedings. And uh, the questions have already been put to you. And as you already indicated uh, in the session, that your testimony is not as fresh as it would have been before the Office of Co-Investigating Judges. Uh, However, the chamber has noted that you have doing your best to respond to all the questions put to you as needed. The chamber has no further questions to be put to you, and uh, we would like to let you go back home. The court official is now instructed to make any necessary arrangements and consult with the Vesu unit to make sure that Mr. Saumet is well taken back to his home safe and sound. Since it is now time to take adjournment, we'll take the adjournment now and resume at 5 to 11. The greffier, all rise.